Greetings, my dear beloved children. Today I'd like to complete our conversation about an upbringing of the man of the future. Many of you, who bring up young children, have realized how different they are, freedom-loving, uninhibited, observant, intelligent and talented. And now, dear ones, so much depends on you, if you could preserve these special qualities in them, develop, nurture and grow them carefully. I know, it is difficult for many of you, because life circumstances do not allow you to devote yourselves to your children only, and you have to enroll them into nursery schools, kindergartens and schools, which often do not satisfy your spiritual needs and where they seemingly break the soul of your child. But still the most important part of the upbringing depends on you. If you create in your family an atmosphere of love, harmony and mutual understanding with your child, you could minimize any outside influence. And it is very important to be wise here. Under any circumstances, do not blame or judge the teachers, educators or other children, whom your child meets outside your home. Otherwise, he will involuntarily transfer your opinions, meaning he will radiate the energy of mistrust, judgment, criticism and then, according to the law of reflection, he will receive in return more negative emotions from his peers and teachers. Your task is to teach a child to regard calmly and with understanding absolutely everyone. It is not easy, but possible. Now I will give you one advice how to help your child to survive in the 3D world, while staying in the 5D world with his consciousness. Try to transform all his life into a play. Tell him, that all the children in his nursery school or in kindergarten are beautiful angels of light, but they wanted to play and as part of the game started to put on the masks of bullies, greedy, rude or cunning people. And now these masked children are testing how other children will react to that. They are very interested and very curious about that. And, if he wants to, your child could become a magician, who will take off the masks from the villains, and under the masks he will surely see beautiful gentle angels. Thus, he will gradually transform his offenders into friends. But to do that, you have to give him a magic wand. It could be anything, depending on the fantasy of your child and his character. It is important, that his wand will be charged with the energy of unconditional love, which his little heart radiates. Let your child imagine that he touches his offenders with this divine wand and then observe what their reaction will be. And if he would be able to do it sincerely, then he will see the results of his magic instantly, negative energy won't be able to penetrate through the light radiated by your child. And, believe me, dear ones, as soon as your child will see his first results, and it will surely appear, he would like to continue playing this game forever. It will turn into a habit, in his way of life, in his natural state. Thus, unnoticeably, the birth of the man of the future will happen, and the more children like that will be on earth the sooner she will raise her dense body into a long-awaited divine space of 5D. I bless you, dear ones, for wise, patient and loving regard for the small citizens of your planet. Father Absolute, who loves you without measure, has spoken to you.